ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶ್ಚ ಕಿಪಾಸಿಂಧುಭ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧೋ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸ್ವತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ್ವ ನರುಂಚೈವನರುತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸ್ವರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರುಣ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಭವಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಚನು ತರಣ್ಯಂ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರಬಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪೂಷ್ಮದರ್ಶಿ ಪುರುನಾನುರಾಗರ ಸುಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜರೌ ಜುಗಧಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾವತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿಪರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಚ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮನೀಯಟಾಕಲಾಪಂ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನುಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಶ್ರಚಕ್ಷಸೆ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಭೀರ್ ತ್ವಂ ನಿಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
तदेव रम रुचि नवम नवम तदेव सद मनसो महसदम तदेव शोकर्णवशोषण निना जदुतम श्रौकजसो अनुगीयते तदेव रम रुचि नवम नवम तदेव सद मनसो महसम तदेव रम रुचि नवम नवम तदेव सद मनसो महोत्सव तदेव शोकर्णवशोषण निना जदुतम श्लोकजसो अनुगीयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभात परमंश जगदगुरु टोल आई कैन कम डाउन टू एनी लेवल फॉर द एक्चुअल पीचिंग ऑफ चैतन्य वाणी गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभात जगदगुरु टोल I can come down to any level for the actual preaching of Gauravani. People are going to misunderstand. People are going to misunderstand. They cannot understand why Pope is speaking this way. This is not good. Why Pope is going to speak this way? Like you can remember. When Bindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya wanted to provide a kick on my head, I mean the head of people, those who are not ready at all to accept the glories of Nityananda, even after hearing so many things about Nityananda, even after hearing so many things about Nityananda. they are not ready to accept that's why bindavan das chakur told then i can provide kick on their head now common people they are not going to accept this kind of mood they say what is this his vaishnav is going to provide a kick on my head our head It's not good. It's not Vishnu at all. They don't understand the mood of Guru Vishnu. It is written in Shastra. Vishnu ver Kriya Mudra. Begin a bujhai. All the activities of Guru Vishnu. Big big personality. Those are knowledgeable maybe. They still cannot understand. Vaishnavir Kriya Mudra. I mean, what they are doing, what they are doing, why they are speaking. Nobody can understand. Even maybe he is learned man. Vaishnavir Kriya Mudra. Begin abujai. Again, it is written. Vaishnavir Kriya Mudra. Even the demigods in the heaven. Vaishnav Chinite Nare. वैष्णव छिनी वैष्णव छिनी थे अंड देवर शक्ति इवन डिमीगॉड्स दे कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड द मूड ऑफ वैष्णव डिमीगॉड्स दे आर इन फेवर ऑफ भगवान वी नो डिमीगॉड्स दे आर इन फेवर ऑफ भगवान बट नॉट दैट दे आर टोटली डेडिकेटेड हंड्रेड परसेंट नॉट दैट सो They are in favor of Bhagwan, okay, but not like pure Guru Vishnu. That's why demigods also they are interested to take darshan of pure Guru Vishnu. I told one or two incident before, like the case of Guru Path Padma. Demigods coming to take darshan of Siddhar Goshi Maharaj, Bhakti Bhavan Puri Goshi Maharaj. This is not strange. It's quite natural. To purify themselves, they are coming. It is not strange. You can say what is strange? They are demigods. So what? They are coming to purify themselves. That's why they are coming. Whereas Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is speaking, I am touching you. I am embracing you to purify myself. So what about demigods? 
even Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking himself. Sanatana speaking, don't touch me. I develop some, you know, scabies. Don't touch me. Mahaprabhu forcefully touch him, embrace him. Mahaprabhu speaking, Sanatana, I am actually touching you to purify myself. Your pure quality, not there in me. Chaitanya speaking, all your pure quality is there in you. I don't have. What is that pure quality? You know what is that pure quality? Pure quality means extreme love, loveful seva. Extreme loveful seva. That is called quality. Quality, what, what quality we can think? So, if demigod speaking about demigods, if it is written in Shastra, nothing wrong in it, it's okay. I can speak of one or two, one incident more. Srila Bhangshidas Babaji Maharaj, usually he is not going anywhere, but sometime going. <coughs> when Vaishnava moving here and there, Mahat Bichalanam Nimam, Mahat Bichalanam Nimam, Ninam, Grihinam Dina Chetasam, Nisraya Sayo, Nanatha Kalpate Kachit. When a Vaishnava travelling here and there, be sure, not that they are travelling due to their chanchal vav. If you tell they are chanchal, restless, that's why not that. In Shastra it is confirmed, Mahat Bichalanam Ninam, Mahat Bichalanam Ninam, Gihinam Dina Chetasam, Nisya Sahaya Kalpati Nan, Nisya Sahaya Nanatha Kalpati Kachit. Not for any other reason. They are going according to the inspiration of Bhagavan, they are running to best keeper on bonded soul. Shukdev Goswami, topmost Paramahansa. We cannot expect that Sukhde Goswami to run here and there. But Sukhde Goswami travelling according to the desire of Bhagavan. Who going to inform, who going to inform Parikit, who going to inform Sukhde Goswami that there is Parikit Maharaj, please uh, he is now going to die, you go. Who inform? Anybody inform? Nobody inform. He is totally exclusively he is totally leading life exclusively. He is actually, those are Paramahansa, if you put them uh, exclusively, they can lead because they are association mentally. So, Sukhdev Goswami running according to the inspiration of Bhagavan. Bhagavan sitting inside. According to that inspiration, Sukhdev Goswami running and there is one very important thing that Bhagavan wanted to preach Bhagavad Katha. Bhagavan wanted to preach Bhagavad Katha through Sukhdev Goswami. That is why giving inspiration, you go there. Otherwise, he is running here, here. Don't talk with anybody, no connection with the material world, nothing. How possible he is running and running and coming to Hastinapur from there reaching and uh, Sukta, Sukta Khetra. There are thousands of Rishi gathered there. The last time a Parikshit Maharaj is going to leave his body with full, with full determination and bow. He is sitting there to leave body, by probation. Up to the last moment of life he is going to sit there to concentrate his mind and the lotus feet of Bhagavan. He wanted to find some solution of life Though we know solution is already there with Parikhidma, whom Bhagavan already gave darshan, gave darshan, whom Bhagavan already gave darshan in the womb. A solution is Jiva? No, solution. But still, he wanted to find solution, asking different questions to Rishi Manis. Finally, by the desire of Bhagavan, Sri Krishna is going to reach that spot and he started speaking Bhagavad Katha. Point is that 
those pure devotees, big, big sadhus, they are traveling according to the inspiration of Bhagavan, not uh, fancifully. So I was speaking, even the demigods in the heaven, they cannot understand a devotee. One incident I can speak, then I can go to topics. The question of preaching, question of actual preaching. Actually, he is not speaking Harikatha. Our Bhangshidas Bhavaji is not speaking Harikatha. You heard any time that Bhangshidas Bhavaji is speaking Harikatha or you heard that Gorkishar Bhavaji Maharaj, ha, Gorkishar sometimes speaking something, one or two sentences. You heard any time that Sanatana Goswami giving passing lecture to somebody. You heard any time that Rupa Goswami Bhai wanted to pass lecture to somebody. You heard Jiva Goswami Bhai giving lecture to somebody. Raghunanda Goswami, Gopal Bhattu Goswami. Their acharan itself is Harikatha. I can come to the point, uh, first of all I discuss this point, very important. It can break your heart. If it is not made up of th thunderbolt, bhajira, then your heart can crack down by hearing this. How much humbleness, how much submission, how much love. Our mind is scattered to different places of attraction, different object of attraction. Bhangshidas Bhaji Maharaj sometime going to at present Bangladesh, sometime going, walking, sometime going here and there. One day Bhangshidas Mahaji Maharaj gone to Kashi Vishwanath, Baranasi. He gone to Baranasi to take darshan of Vishwanath. He is Vaishnava himself is going to take the Sunaba walking, walking, going there. Kashi Vishwanath. There, Bhangshidas Bhavaji Maharaj going to make a small bhajan kutir, very small, uh, unstable bhajan kutir, because anyway he is not going to stay for a long time. And there he is staying. Very nice, uh, with some, uh, you know, a straw and these they are making and doing bhajan inside. And sometimes going under the guidance of Gauranga Mahaprabhu also used to take darshan of Baranasi. Kashi Vishwana is Vaishnava. One day, that was the British time. That was British time. British military man, there was on camp, military camp at the bank of Ganga. Long, <coughs> long distance. <coughs> From their night time, those military men watching, there is a high megawatt of light. High megawatt of light, where from this light coming? Military men watching from long distance. Military men with gun coming, who is there, who can say? Military men coming, they watch, there is nothing. There was a light there from long distance they watching. When they come to search out, nothing there. Even they go away long distance, they find light. They cannot understand. Finally it was discovered that Annapurna, Annapurna Ma, Kashi Vishwanath and wife Annapurna, <coughs> Shakti, Annapurna came to take darshan of Bhangshidas Bhavaji Maharaj. That's why out of his body, effulgence, there was so much light all around. Similar thing, my Guru Mahatma. You see what, who is there at the window? And window, who is there now? Oh, so much light there. You watch who is there. He must be there. You call him. So, we should not express any doubt. So, we should not express any doubt and suspicion about pure Guru Vishnu. Bindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya, why going to provide kick on our head? It is also a question of preaching. It is also a question of preaching. Why Bindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya wanted to provide a kick on on head of our public? This is because of preaching. Because common people, yesterday I told, 
Naishang muti stavat urukramangin spishati anatha bhagama jadartha mahiya saam padaro jubishekam niskinchana anam na vinitu yao. Yesterday afternoon time has been. Naishang mati stavat urukramangin spishata anartha apagama jadartha mahiya saam padaro jubishekam niskinchana anam na vinitu yao. <coughs> so long as, so long as you are not going to get one dust particle from the lotus feet of a pure Sadhu Guru Vaishnava, your brain cannot touch the lotus feet of Bhagavan. It is contaminated brain, cannot be. So yesterday I told, dust particle from the lotus feet of pure Vaishnava, Water was from the lotus feet of a Vaishnava and Uchishta Prasad of Vaishnava, thin, very, very, very powerful medicine for us, bonded soul. It can, at the same time, it can clear our heart, give, give us power to go chitbal, you can get chitbal to go up and down. Valuation of human being. Sometimes we, sometime we give honor to people. Sometimes we give honor to people according to their position, designation. Oh, he is prime minister. He is, you know, president. This way. But in Sastra, it is written, man should be given honor according to their degree of consciousness. Man cannot be given honor because they are holding this post. He is Achai, he is this, that. Maybe. But who knows the degree of consciousness there inside the man? Who knows? You know or I know? Bhagavan can realize. So, valuation of human being. So, the valuation of human being depends upon the degree of consciousness they have. They have achieved. They have achieved according to that. Consciousness, low level, I can honor because he has a lot of money. It's an idiotic conception. It's a foolish conception. So many times I told, senior, seniority should be given priority. Majority must be granted. All material things. It is not good. Seniority should be given priority. Okay, it's in material world it is applicable. But seniority should be given priority, is not applicable in Aprakita Jaga. There are only one thing, that is how much consciousness he has, how much love he has for the Supreme Law. That's why all Rishi Muni, thousands of Rishi Muni, they are going to give honor to Shukdev Kushan, whereas he is 16 years boy. There are so many Rishi, there are thousands of years they are living. Thousands of years they are doing bhajan. But even still they are going to give honor to Shukadev Goswami. That's a very important thing. So Bindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya is going to provide, uh, want to provide kick on our head. Why? That is also for preaching. Why? Well, he want to, uh, he want to help us. He want to help us. He wants to help us to develop our consciousness by giving dust particle on our head, this much. But you misunderstand me. He wants to help us to develop our consciousness by giving his dust particle of his lotus feet to on our head. Same thing I told, Naishang Mati Stavadur. He knows they cannot reach, so better I can give my dust particle on their head. So they can develop their consciousness, they can understand Bhagavan with this mood, not with other mood. But common people be going to speak, he has no, he is not at all Vaishnava. Vaishnava is humble, there is no humbleness. So many times we misunderstand Vaishnava. When they are speaking heavy, when they are speaking so heavy, we think he is criticizing, he is speaking this way, he ah, is not Vaishnava. Vaishnava should not speak about others. But, Baba speaking, for the benefit of public, for the benefit of public, we can open the dirty attitude or the some 
Kapat sannyasi, kapat achayas. Pope was speaking. I am not saying, I can show you. Those kapat, those cheater, their character and behavior should be brought into light of common people so that they cannot cheat public. So sometimes Guru Vaishnava barking like dog. You, sometimes they are barking like dog, but you misunderstand them. Why they are going this way? Whereas there is also double problem. This is one problem. The double problem can come when one elevated Vaishnava is going to show such humbleness which is beyond your conception. It's double problem for us. Vindavan Das Chakram is okay, we face problem, we don't. It is okay, but sometimes Vaishnavas, they are acting in such a way, humbleness, it is double problem for us. We don't understand the actual behavior of Vaishnava. Like the case of Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami, like the case of Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami, Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami is speaking that I am more and more inferior than Jagai Madai. Jagai Madai hoise muise papishto, purisher kit hoise muise logisto. Mor nam jai loy tar pap hoy, mor nam jai shune tar punno khoy. Amon ne grinno more keva ki bakore, ek ne tanun do vinu jagat machare. You should memorize these words. It is one kind of jewel in our life. It is one kind of jewel. Why we cannot develop the book? I can discuss maybe tomorrow, one time, so many things. Why, why we are hearing so many harikatha? So many things we are learning, we are going to learn this, that. But we are not getting stability of knowledge. Already here, okay, for some, but going on. Because we have no stability of our, you know, we have no stability of our character, behavior. We have no settlement of our demand, desire. If there is karma, <coughs> if there is, <coughs> if there is karma, then you cannot get knowledge. Karma and knowledge together cannot come. Kama and Prema cannot come together. Kama and Prema cannot come together. Kama and pure knowledge cannot come together. That's why most of the people, they are speaking story in the Nima Bharikata. They are not enjoying Kripa of Guru Pata. That's why they cannot remember how they can speak. First of all, you should realize yourself then after that you can speak to us. Without realization, how much you can, how much, how far you can memorize your memory power. So that's why I can discuss this point. There is karma inside our heart, that's why you cannot remember anything. There is karma inside our heart, that's why we cannot remember. Karma can make you unstable and stability of your knowledge uh, cannot stay. It can go away. So those who are big, big, you know, devotee, they are very, very highly. Their concentration is one-pointed. Concentration is one point. So when Krishna Kavira Goswami is going to speak this way, that I am even more inferior I am even more inferior than Jagai Madai. I am even more inferior than the insect in the insect you find in stool. I am more inferior than the insect available in stool. I am more fallen. Hello. If somebody going to speak my name, they is going to lose all his result of pious activities, everything is going to. When somebody is going to hear my name, he is going to lose everything, all his past deeds, everything. When somebody is speaking my name, he is going to incur. If somebody is going to speak my name, he is going to incur. What? Incur? Sin, fool. Going to invite sin. Pap, pap, sin. When somebody hearing my name, 
is going to lose all is the result of his pious activities previous all done all finish this kind of humbleness is also double danger for us is not normal this is not normal humbleness this humbleness is so extreme humbleness which is only possible if somebody can discover his position unto the lotus of radharani only then address not possible extreme humbleness so it is double danger for us and krishna das kubiras goswami is speaking if nitananda prabhu is the only support for us guru nitananda is the only support for us krishna das kubiras goswami is speaking nitananda is my only support if nitananda going to ignore me then there is no place in this infinity universe joshu prasadat bhagavat prasado joshu prasadat nagati guto api thanks to bangs tasya jasasya sandyam bande guru si charnal what is the meaning here without the mercy of gurudev we have no stability we can go down and down joshu prasada bhagavat prasad who skipa if gurudev going to give kipa be sure it is the kipa of supreme lord joshu prasada bhagavat prasad he is going to best to kipa i am surely i can think it is the kipa bhagwan through gurudev joshu prasad bhagavat prasad joshu prasad if he become if he is not satisfied with me joshu prasad joshu prasad mean if you are satisfied with me bless me joshu prasad mean if gurudev is not satisfied with me according my activity everything then i can get no stability anywhere in this fourteen world anywhere i can go kali moving and going moving and going up and down i can burn myself because this burning mean if there is kamana vasana then you are burning no kamana vasana what kind of burning burning mean kamana vasana that's why burning no kamana vasana no burning i very stable ah very nice whole world is very blissful place kamana vasana is you know is a reason for why we are feeling so helpless we are feeling unstable we are burning in heart we got different is a coming we are not going to fulfill we become angry like in gita bhagwan speaking na dhayatu vishanapung sham sangaste supayayati dhayatu if i am going to meditate on any matter of enjoyment i need it without which my life is useless suppose somebody going to love on lady hello material man beautiful lady he is going to think that i cannot live with her with her i will have to get it so he is concentrating and anyway there is so many impediments in the way of fulfilling your heart there so many in for their competitor some other man going to love that lady and they are fighting a oh, sweet friend going to love one lady i know practically one friend ultimately is bound to step step you know kill one friend and after hearing this another friend flying gone and the friend is going to kill another friend he was arrested by police and another fly so what is the result of material love there is no woman only one woman in the world in the universe i need her <laughs> maya magic spell of maya maya can compel you maya can compel you to commit suicide it is one kind of suicide because you are anyway not going to take advantage of a spiritual development so it is one kind of suicide so this way big danger people not going to get stability chanchal all the time 
So when Vrindavan Dasyakur Mahas are speaking, then we'll have to think twice before passing any remark. And when we are going to think about Krishna Das Govindas Goswami, there's a more danger because we cannot we can misunderstand. Ah, useless. Who is going to identify himself as the insect of a stool? More than ah, oh, we cannot hear him. Come on, he is going to identify himself as a more inferior creature than the insect available in the stool. So why? What we can do by hearing him? But they don't know. He is going to pass this kind of remark because he has eternal place unto the lotus feet of Radharani. Radharani. Otherwise, it's this kind of. So, Joshua Prasada Bhagavat Prasada. By the mercy of Guru, we can get Kripa Bhagavan. Same thing. But if Gurudev is not satisfied with me, Vaishnav Gurudev, then I cannot get stability even in this protein world. Right. So, same thing. Nityananda Prabhu is so merciful that even he wanted to bestow keep on, on to characterless, most sinful figure to Jagai Madai. That is one kind of extreme example. Extreme example, I mean the topmost idealism of Kripa. Then Nichananda Baba want to, they are all character, less fall and so dirty, so dirty. But still Nichananda wanted to deliver. Though they wanted to break the hate of. Because, why? For the preaching of Chaitanya Bani. Why Nichananda took trouble? Because he loved Gauranga. Anyway, he liked to preach the glories of Gauranga. This is the reason. This is the only reason. Otherwise, what reason? Nithyananda is going to you know, express this kind of lila to glorify Gauranga for the preaching of Chaitanya Bhani. Nithyananda is ready to come down to any level to deliver Gaur Nitha. What to speak more? Gauranga Mahapu told that if Nityananda is going to accept, it is written in Chaitanya Bhagavad, you can go and read. Gauranga Mahapu giving warning to all devotees, if my Nityananda is going to accept one Muslim woman in his life, Muslim, Javan, still you should not misunderstand him. Because all his activities, whatever he is doing, externally you can think good or bad, but all the mood of Nityananda is driven by my love. I mean, this is the inner meaning. If Nityananda is going to accept one Muslim lady in his life, still he should not miss it. Still he is worshipable of Brahma, Sankar, infinity world. Even Gauranga Mahapu like to worship Nityananda. So you understand the position of Guru. Now you understand the position of Guru, what position Guru? So if you are going to think like a human being, then big problem. Now Nithyananda Prabhu, when going to bestow Kipa on Jagai Mahadai, and by the blessing of Nithyananda and Gauranga, Jagai Mahadai, how? Finally Gauranga Mahapu is going to embrace Jagai Mahadai. So, surely Jagai Mahadha, when Gauranga Mahapu is going, <coughs> going to embrace Jagai Mahadha, so can you expect Gauranga Mahapu, uh, uh, what you can expect? That means the fire, the fire of, the fire of Sarup Shakti, the fire of Sarup Shakti entering into Jagai Mahadha immediately to burn up all infinity misactivities. Sinful activities. A fire of Sarva Shakti entering into Jagai Madai and going to burn up all infinity sinful activities, all result. Immediately they purify themselves, they express the mood of Seva. So Gauranga Mahapu, by the same thing, by the embrace of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, the leprosy disease, 
Kushti Vipro. Vasudev Vipro, Kushti. Oh, whole body full of leprosy. Very poisonous blood and bad blood coming out. But still, he was very interested to take darshan of that Supreme Lord, Gauranga. When he heard from Kurma Vipra, just Prabhu gone. Prabhu gone? I heard he is coming to deliver us all. So I come, he is gone. Immediately faint, fall down on ground. Prabhu gone, then hopeless I am. In the meantime, Prabhu gone long distance. Prabhu again come back, appear. Prabhu appear, long distance gone. Chart, Prabhu appear. Prabhu appear and embrace that, that Kushti Vipra. Kushti Vipra. And then that body become very purified. I started crying, Prabhu. It was good for me. It was good for me. Why you rectify my leprosy? It was good. At least I was humble. At least I was very humble. Now my body you make okay. Then I can express, you know, different desire, annavilas. And I can expect honor from other people. So long I am neglected, it's good for me. Your intellect cannot reach up to that far. Maybe day by day I can discuss all this one, tomorrow also. But right now your intellect cannot touch this point. How excellent it is. You will have to wait and take trouble to do Hari Bhajan. Without any kapat bhav, without any enjoying mood, you will have to do. Otherwise, you cannot get the thing for why you are coming to me. You cannot get now. So when Krishnadas Kubiras Goswami is going to speak this way, very humble way, then it's more danger because we can say, the what use? He is going to identify himself as a useless. He is going to identify himself as a more inferior than more inferior than the insect available in stool. So we are less interested to hear. This is more dangerous. Very dangerous. Because we are going to neglect that Vaishnav. Whereas he is the topmost Vaishnav. This way, when Popa told, I can come down to any level for the actual preaching of Gaurvani, I already explained the Siddhanta Vichar. Perhaps you never heard. Perhaps in your whole life, never heard. Nobody heard, I think. It's by the desire of Prabhupada and Guru Bhargava, it appears inside my heart. I mean, this kind of Leela shown by Nityananda is only and only for the preaching of Gauranga. Nityananda wanted to glorify. I can kiss the I speak the one case, I mean, when Balaji Maharaj wanted to. Eh? Balaji Maharaj. Balaj, actually, Guru, Guru Tattva is very complicated, you cannot understand. Very. Deep tatta, very deep rooted. Gurudev is so merciful that even fallen soul like Duryodhan, he is also going to get some kipa, but he cannot utilize. Balaji Maharaj wanted to show some kipa to Bal Balaji Maharaj even even Balaji Maharaj even wanted to show some kipa to Duryodhan, but Duryodhan was not in a position to accept kipa. This is a case. My Guru Padma wanted to give so many kipa to me, taking a lap, my my you know, a crazy son, my but I couldn't care. It is my fault. He wanted to give so many kipa. See, it's quite natural. Guru Vaishnava always like to bestow kipa on fallen souls so that they can increase their consciousness, they can realize without Krishna Vajan, Krishna Seva. There is no other objective in our life. Our only goal should be Hari Bhajan. When our only goal is to do Hari Bhajan, that is called the actual mood of Hari Bhajan. 
That's called actual mood of Krishna Bhajan, Hari Bhajan. Anyway, so you see, Popad is always speaking that I am, I am ready to go to any level, come down to any level. Even Popad wanted to say that to carry out the order of my Guru Pad Padma, to carry out the order of my Guru Pad Padma, if I need to go to hell forever with due contact, I can, I am ready to do. You see, to carry out the order of Vaishnava Guru, Paramahansa Guru, if I need to go to hell forever with due contact, I am ready to go. That's why yesterday I told, when Arjun now ready to ready to do anything what Krishna speaks, that is actual symptom of a disciple. To carry out the order, karishya bachanam tava. Karishya bachanam tava, this is the actual symptom of a disciple. When disciple is ready to carry out the order of Guru Padma, Whatever difficult it may be, however difficult it may be, that is called the actual symptom of. Uh, so now we know that Bhagwan Sri Krishna giving order to Uddhavji Maharaj, you will have to stay here. I find nobody, I find nobody whom I can keep as representative in this material world. You will have to stay, is my order. Otherwise, who can preach? So Krishna Bhagavan going to going to take decision to appoint Uddhavji Maharaj as the representative, I mean the preacher of Gauriya Siddhanta Bichar. Preacher of Gauriya Siddhanta Bichar. I mean Bhagavad Dharma. Also, two days before I told that the desire of Brahma. Brahma wanted to give some instruction to his son, Naraji Maharaj, that with this mood you will have to preach, be careful. So Naraji Maharaj also going to give this kind of instruction to Vyasadevji Maharaj. So this way propagating. This way propagating. So actually, Brahma speaking, idam bhagavatam namo, Janme Bhagavato Ditam. I told you, na? Idam Bhagavatam Namo Janme Bhagavato Ditam Sangraho Ayam Vibhutinam Tamitat Bipuli Kuru. You try to expand. I am speaking in gist, but if you. Same thing Mahaprabhu told. To Rupa Goswami Sanatan. Sanatan, when you can sit to write, Automatically, Krishna can come inside your heart and can, you can expand. I am speaking all in gist. Mahaprabhu, you can go to Chaitanya, you are reading Chaitanya Bhagavad like blind. <laughs> you can go, it is written. Mahaprabhu speaking, whenever you are going to sit to write, then you can realize everything, you can do some expansion of what, what teachings I am giving in gist, you can conceive you can understand some expansion. So, e, so Brahma speaking to Narada, Evam, Idam, Idam Bhagavatam Namo Janme Bhagavato Ditam. I received it from Bhagavan directly. And Sangraho Aya Vibhutinam Tamitat Vibhulikru. And after that, Bhagavan saying, You will have to preach in such a way so that people can develop bhakti inside, inside their heart. You will have to preach this Bhagavad Tattva Vigyan. You will have to preach this Bhagavad Tattva Vigyan in such a way, so that you will have to preach this Bhagavad Tattva Vigyan in such a way, so that common public are not mis misguided. Common people can develop bhakti unto the lotus feet of Bhagavan. 
यथा हरो भगवती नीनाम भक्तिर्भविष्यति यथा हरो भगवती नीनाम भक्तिर्भविष्यति यथा यथा यू वेल टू प्रीच एंड सच वे यथा भगवती हरो हरो भगवती नीनाम भक्तिर भविष्यति भविष्यति मैंने दे कैन डेवलप भक्ति with this determination with this determination yatha haro nenam yatha aro bhagavati nenam bhakti bhakti bhavishyati iti sankalpo this kind of sankalpo determination varnayo with this determination You have to preach. Now you understand the strict regulation. Now you understand now the present situation. Strict instruction of Brahma. You should not preach for other purpose to get some money, position, girl, and oh, Jagat Guru, this that. No, not this way. If you are going to do this way, you will have to get punishment. For infinity period. If you are going to misguide yourself alone, it's okay. If you are going to guide yourself wrong way, it's okay. Still okay. I can do what 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 it concern to you. But when you are going to misguide yourself, at the same time you are going to misguide thousands of people all over the world. Then what kind of punishment you can get? Now you see. Now you see. If you are going to misguide yourself, you are going to misguide yourself because you are not in line with Guru Varga. At the same time, you are going to misguide thousands of people. What kind of punishment is waiting for you? Jatha haru ni, jatha haru, jatha haru Bhagavati ni nam bhakti bhavishvati. With this determination, iti shankalpo varnayo. With this determination, you have to preach so that they can get bhakti. I mean to deliver. There is an instruction of Bhagwan. So Bhagwan Sri Krishna is speaking to Udhav. You can think, you can think, you are not right personality. You are think you are unfit. But I know, but I know myself that even in heaven, this kind of knowledgeable personality life is not available. So you must. Actually, those who are paramansa, they are going to learn so many things from this material world. You you have no idea. Paramansa bhakti is so clever; he can learn something from you. Something from you, something from you, everything. They can learn. They can learn. Tick, tick, tick. They can like honey bees collecting honey, na? A paramansa can collect all different knowledge, even from the material world. You can. What is knowledge there? Material knowledge. Ah. Material knowledge. But they can filter that material knowledge and accept in their life so that it can become suitable. For a prakriti jagat. Otherwise, why we are going to learn? If I give you, if I give you, if if I give you lot of flower, lot of flower I can give. And if I say out of this flower you give me uh, some honey, is that how possible? I give you flower. Flower is the source of honey. I cannot give. How? Why cannot give? You can make one big grinder. You can paste all honey. By pasting, you can give me. I can give you lot of flower. You can make a paste and give me honey. Is possible for you? Not possible. Because honey bees can collect honey. Only honey bees can collect honey. Ordinary people can. They have no capacity. This kind of technique is only with honey bees. So you will have to. 
so you will have to depend upon honey bees to get honey you will have to depend upon honey bees to collect honey to get honey no other sources similarly you are bound to depend upon pure guru vishnu those who are honey bees of prakriti jagat they are always collecting they say so this way bhagwan sri krishna now uh, going to speak to uddhav uddhav uh, well i can speak some topics about jodu maharaj and some avadhut yesterday i told i couldn't explain that why jodu maharaj is enjoying so much kripa so much honor why krishna going to give honor to jodu maharaj in his name he is going to accept jodu destiny bhagwan jadav na jodu jodu bamsa we are speaking jodu bamsa jodu destiny we are speaking what is the reason why bhagwan giving to so much honor to jodu so that everybody can say oh jodu bamsa jodu bamsa jodu destiny why jodu bar jadav krishna vanne bhav krishna jadav hmm jadavendra vanne bhav krishna jadav mean total those who are in the jodu destiny the reason mind is that the extreme devotee extreme devotion of jodu maharaj unto the lotus feet of bhagwan that is the reason extreme devotional mood of jodu maharaj unto the lotus feet of bhagwan that is the reason the father name of father i mean the name of father of jodu was jajati name of father jajati jajati actually was in trap of maya jajati in fact man he was very good man but anyway good or bad if somebody going to be involved in maya what to do hello jodu <laughs> jodu is enjoying full honor and jajati is not bad man he is a nice nice man is king but anyway he was in the trap of maya he was bound to marry one brahman girl whereas it is prohibited kshatriya one kshatriya should not marry one brahman girl follow one brahman should not marry one kshatriya girl prohibited varna ashram category it can break down the total system can break down <coughs> total system can break down that's why it's prohibited it is called bilomo yataha you have no conception about it i discussed in gita so many thing about varna samdharma how whole society going to be contaminated one brahman going to marry one shudra girl shudra girl going to marry one brahman i can show you so contamination i mean pure flow of this you know flow of varnasam dharma not possible at present all contaminated if we are failure to maintain pure varnasam dharma it is a great danger for whole society like the situation at present some of them that again tilak mala this that only for to take some advantage and do advantage so that they can be known as devotee he can marry somebody very this way they are playing trick it is not devotion it is not devotion to understand pure devotion you will have to wait you will have to know so many thing so shuto dev goshami why we say why you say shuto shuto mean there shuto dev goshami is speaking bilomo jataha bilomo jataha mean mother was vaishya maybe maybe mother was vaishya father was khatriya or maybe uh, father was this and mother was bilomo contamination 
That's why Sutta Goswami it is written, Bayam Biloma Yataha. That is the reason. <coughs> there should be pure flow is now broke, break, broken, totally break down. And common people, they cannot understand what is the scientific ground behind it. They can express doubt, they can become angry. They don't know why, why Dronacharya was bound to take the right hand thumb of Ekalabhya. Whole, whole world criticizing. Ah, useless. Useless. He's going to take the... As a nice, you know, uh, he... They don't know why Dronacharya wanted to take the right hand thumb as a donation, as a pranami of Ekalab. You don't know. They have no idea. But they don't know Ekalab was very low caste, tribal. Akalabbo unnecessarily wanted to get this kind of knowledge of bow and arrow, which is Annavilas, which can be treated as Annavilas. Follow. If one Shudra, if one Shudra fallen so, he wants to enter into temple to worship deity, who can allow? You can allow? At present, everybody, hello. Oh, okay. Oh, Maharaj, no man there, they cannot see. Now open to all. This uh, Paramahari Siddhar Goswami used to say, in kitchen, in deity room, you cannot allow everybody. Same thing, same formula. I was number one enemy in my temple because I was very strict regulation. I cannot allow one Brahmachari to talk with one Mataji. If I look, look from up, I become very strict. They cannot. One Mataji, after 9 o'clock, unnecessarily, unnecessarily can stay out of temple, I cannot allow. It happens so. I give punishment. I repeatedly told, after 9 o'clock, I can close the room, close temple. If you are going for other, you will have to inform her why you are going. What is the reason? And with whom you are going? What purpose? If not, after 9. It's some, some Mataji is coming after 9 o'clock. I don't open, he is crying outside temple, foreign Matajis. After heavily crying, then I open, I give punishment. Follow, this is my strict rule. I cannot anybody to enter into into kitchen room. No. Very strict. So I was a number one enemy. I cannot allow. This kind of Sahaja proceeding. You will have to follow rules and regulations. Because if, come on, you come to get bhakti. So, we see, it's very, very difficult to understand why Akalabha is actually anyway, Akalabha is should, not even Shudra. It was from tribal. But what is the reason for why you like to learn so much? Okay, you... Okay, for hunting you can do something, but it's a fine art if you like to get. Why? What reason? It is have no utility for you. Anyway, you are not going to invite, you are not going to be invited by one fighting party, one king that you can fight in the. So it is Annavilas. According to your grade, according to your grade, according to your sanskar, you will have to do. According to your grade. According to the sanskar, you will have to drive yourself. If you are going to break the rules, going to jump into some other category, other platform, strictly prohibited. So it was the commitment, it was the promise of Donacharya. It was the promise of Donacharya in front of Arjun. You are the topmost disciple. You are my topmost disciple. Dronacharya told to Arjun, you are my topmost disciple, nobody can exceed you. But now, when Arjun finds some tribal man going to grow this kind of technique, then going to screw them, how possible? Well, let me go, let me see. How it is possible? Dronacharya, he is not going to learn from Dronacharya, only making one model. Only making one model and he is going to worship and getting. 
Here one very, very fine Siddhanta Vichar. From deity is going to here. Deity, no, I cannot say deity, model, model I can say. Is going to worship. Concentration of your mind can go, can go up to such a level, even you cannot understand. Your, if you are going to concentrate, that mind has so power, it can go to such a level, so many unknown, unknown, unknown things you can know. Even I know those who are you know, doing, you know, practicing martial art. Martial art. They are concentrating, somebody is going to attack from backside, he can, he can realize. From backside, he is sitting. Somebody attack, he fought. So even in martial art, this kind of technique is available. <laughs> so, when going to some, concentrate on something, photo or something, why not possible? Everything possible. So from photo, for from photo, Ramanujaja took sannyas. If you say it is useless, we cannot uh, believe that he has taken sannyas. It is possible. Our Prabhupada took sannyas from the photo of Gaurkishar Bhavai. But it is positive. And that a Kalabha wanted to do is one negative. It is not, cannot be allowed. Because you are going to break the rules and regulation. Because in society, Varnasam Dharma, that time is very effective. Why you are going to? Because according to your grade, according to your sanskar, you can do. You are Sudra, you like to enter into temple, to worship Shalagram. Why? It is not written and not approved. That's why Dhanacharya one. Dhanacharya could realize that this can be a great problem in future. So he wanted to speak that you think I am your guru, so you will have to give me some Dakshina, Guru Dakshina. So what Guru Dakshina? You will have to give right hand. Because if that right thumb is gone, all his technique, knowledge, not effective. Because how you can pull? You cannot. So anyway, if you cannot pull that. So everybody is going to criticize Dronacharya, but they don't know. Dronacharya wanted to maintain this Varnasram, what is, you know, by... This is the rule. So now, one Paramahansa can learn anything from anywhere. Because they are Paramahansa, they can collect. So, why Jodhu Maharaj was giving so much honor, I already told. He is going to show dedication, perfect dedication unto Lotus Feet of Krishna. And Father unnecessarily wanted to enjoy material enjoyment. For this reason, he wanted to get the young age of his son, Jodhu. Jodhu was not ready. If Jodhu going to get the old age of father in exchange of his young age, then his father can enjoy material karma. But it is not, it is not possible for, because Jodhu, how, Jodhu thinking, if I become old, how I can serve Bhagavan? Not possible, so I cannot help him. So, Jodhu anyway not going to obey the instruction of father. Jodhu not going to fulfill the desire of father. Anyway, material father. But Jodhu want to serve Bhagavan. Jodhu was fully dedicated to That's why he was less interested about what father wanted to. It is not no connection with devotional practice. So, that's why Jodhu was given topmost, Jodhu was given topmost honor in Bhagavatam. So in Jodhu Mangsa, Krishna, so that Jodhu Maharaj, now I to speak. Jodhu Maharaj, that Jodhu Maharaj and one Paramahansa, Jodhu Maharaj was going to, Jodhu Maharaj was going to some place alone and he meet with one Paramahansa who is lying, lying on the ground no neck, no cloth, nothing. But health is very good, nice, nice looking, very powerful. Effulgence, effulgence coming out of body. The Jodhu Maharaj, Jodhu Maharaj was bound to stop. He was very, you know, upset to see why this young man, very new, nice looking, 
so much powerful. Effulgence coming out of body. Why that man lying here doing next to nothing? What can be the reason? Let me ask. Let me ask. So, Atrapi udharantim imam itihasam puratanam abadhutasya sangvadam jadur ami toteyasaha. Jadur, hena, abadhut sangvadam jadur ami toteyasaha. Amito teya jadu in Bhagavatam here. <coughs> Bhagavan Sri is now giving title to jadu. Amito teya. Amito teya jivna. Aparimito you cannot measure. How much powerful. Aparimito men which cannot be measured. Jadu is how powerful you cannot. What do you mean? What do you mean by this word? Amito teya. Amito means beyond your, you know, assumption. Jodi is so powerful. Here two kind of meaning can be there, and ultimately it can become one meaning. But still, apparently, literally, two meaning can be there. One meaning, Jodi is so powerful, strength. He can defeat anybody. Is very powerful. That can be the meaning. Another meaning, due to his exclusive devotion he is having this kind of power due to his exclusive devotion he is going to because the power coming from bhagavan you don't understand my point i can put one question why if there is any any uh, any man who is uh, leading grace the life if they have their children i mean for i mean daughter you know maybe son so i can ask them you cannot control your son you cannot son is not going to obey you daughter not going to obey you anyway not going to obey you or oh, at all obey uh, externally but internally not going to obey you cannot what i mean to say you cannot get control over your uh, over your family members. It's not, you have no controlling. Daughter can go this way, son can go this way, wife can go this way. You are helpless. But you should think repeatedly that how it was possible for Ambarish Maharaj to get control over the whole world is my question to you. You should have this kind of question. How it was possible that Ambarish Maharaj was successful to get control over the whole world? Why Prithu Maharaj was successful to get control over the whole world? Shaptadip Adhipati. Total world. They were successful to get control. Parikhit Maharaj, come on. So powerful. What is the reason? You can say, because of their Devotion. Bhakti is a Sakti. You know Bhakti? Bhakti is a Sakti. Their Bhakti is a Sakti. If Bhagavan is going to obey you, I already told the definition of Bhakti. I already told, today I have no time. Definition of Bhakti, it can catch Bhagavan, pull Bhagavan. If out of your devotional you know, service, you can control Bhagavan. Why you cannot control, get control over the whole world? Because in Bhagavan, whole infinity, yatro, yeno, yato, yasu, yasmai, yajjad, yada, yada, all Bhagavan. If you, find, if, you, if you want to find out the case ending, case ending, you know, case ending? Are English grammar, case ending, background, case ending, why, what for, who, done by whom, why, which way? All this, all ultimately I can show you is Krishna. Tomorrow I can discuss this point, Today, time cannot permit. Very interesting. Whole life if we sit one place and go on discussing. We can go mad. Where we can go, where we can be taken away. Cannot realize even. So nice nectar. 
तदेव रम रुचि नवम नवम तदेव सदमनसो महोत्सव तदेव सौकर्णव शोषण निना यदुत्तम श्लोक जसो अनुगीयते वाचा कल्पतरो के भाषण दो पचितान पावन भो वैष्णव्यो ओनली दिस उद्धव संवाद होल इयर ओनली दिस उद्धव संवाद आई कैन दिस का होल इयर फुल इयर यू कैन गो ऑन इयर सो डीप फिलोसॉफी 